Um, so I'm here with Julie Hodder, who's a resident of Sandy Bay Road in Clontarf. Um, we've had some issues now for bordering on five, five months since coming, January. Coming so up to six, six months. months. Six months with um, what appears to be, and we now know to be, um, a sewerage leak in the area. Um, we've just spoken to some uh, gentlemen who have explained that they're here to, to pump out um, the sewerage that has leaked in. And when the tides come up, Julie, um, it is getting... Yeah, when the tide comes up, they, well, they've blocked off the sewerage. Um, so that works in low tide and they keep pumping it out. But when the high tide comes in, the high tide goes in through the stormwater pump into the, the pits where they collect all the well, now sewerage, <laughs> um, and, uh, and then it flows back out again. So it's still flowing on the beach sometimes. And I suppose the signs have been up for so long that people have kind of stopped. Ignore it. Well, that first happened in um, January and the place just stunk. Um, a lot of people were complaining about the, the smelliness of it. And they came down, they put in signs and they put in like an orange fence around it. But every time high tide came in, the fence kept falling down. And um, so they, they did that. And then it went on for months and we couldn't figure out why no one was doing anything about it. So one of our neighbours approached the council and also approached Sydney Water, but it wasn't on either one of their radar. Um, when we had the heavy storms here, mm. it was for a few days and then they just closed it and just left the signs up. So it wasn't until we approached the EPA, Sydney Water's now doing something about it. So we've had these people pumping out the, the raw sewerage for two and a half weeks now. So. And, and your your concern, and, and um, what you mentioned to me before, is that you, you have seen your kind of kids playing in there. <laughs> See kids and dogs playing in it. Sometimes I take my dog down there because she, she just lives up above the beach. But yeah. um, I always wash her afterwards because, you know, it still could be polluted. Yeah, that's right. So we'll um, I'll work on getting a little bit more of the information, um, speaking, as I said, to the yeah. EPA um, and to Sydney Water. Uh, but in the meantime, uh, if you're coming down to, to Sandy Bay, <laughs> Um, don't play in the water, at least until they get it fixed. Six, yeah. <laughs>